So Joel, congratulations on the win. How does it feel to be recognized as a leader in graduate recruitment and development? Thank you very much. Look, it, it really does feel wonderful. A, a tremendous amount of focus and effort has gone into our overall graduate recruitment process in Singapore and to be recognized with this HR Excellence Award is incredibly rewarding. Well, that's really nicely said and I'm sure it's a well-deserved win for you and your team. So on that note, what would you say is the secret that helped your organization stand out among the others? Well, for, first of all, hats off to the other companies who, who were recognized. A lot of stiff competition. In, in City's case, my personal view is it came down to our ability to adapt and change our process and not to be scared to do so. We revamped our graduate recruitment process a few years back, moved to a process where we recruited directly into our respective businesses. And then clearly at the start of this year, COVID you know, brought about even more change as we shifted to a virtual process. So I'd say our ability to think on our feet, quickly adapt and be nimble probably helped to set us apart. Well, that's very nicely said, and I'm sure adaptability is a skill that we all need moving forward. So to wrap things up, would you like to share a small shout out to your stakeholders who have supported you on this journey? Absolutely. Um, again, I take zero credit here. Uh, a big shout out to our Asia Pacific Head of Campus Recruiting, uh, Ingrid De Lima, um, our Singapore Head of Campus Recruiting, Eamon Wong, and the rest of the Singapore Campus Recruiting team. Great job. All of you have made City and me extremely proud, so thank you. Well, that's very nicely said and once again, great job to you and your team and this is a really well-deserved win, so congratulations once again. Thank you very much.